18 of the 9-11 victims, meantime, were residents of Bucks County, the highest death toll of any county in the state of Pennsylvania. A ceremony honoring the victims is underway at the Garden of Reflection in Yardley. And that's where we find CBS News Philadelphia reporter Jasmine Payute with the very latest, a very somber day. Good morning, Jasmine. Good morning, Natasha. A very somber day. I'm speaking a little low because that ceremony is happening right now behind me. One of the organizers says even after 22 years, every year is just as painful as the last. You can see just the number of people that came out to honor the people who lost their lives in 9-11. As you mentioned, this was one of the places hit hardest here in Pennsylvania. Take a look at how the ceremony began. The ceremony started with a bell ringing at 8.30. The Garden of Reflection Memorial here was dedicated in 2006. Since then, there have been yearly ceremonies to honor the Bucks County natives who lost their lives on 9-11. Again, we know 18 residents of Bucks County and nine from Lower Makefield Township lost their lives during those attacks. We spoke with one woman about why it was so important to keep her husband's memory alive year after year. It's, it's a hard day, and it's a hard, uh, I've I planned several of these over the years as well, and it's a hard um, balance between uh, celebrating the lives that we lost and acknowledging the, the horrific events, and, um, you know, some years it was just very heavy, um, and hopefully today isn't as heavy. I, um, I mean, it's, it's hard to present this in any other way. It was a heavy day for our nation. But it's an important day to just remember and take stock of what you have in life and appreciate it. Now back here live, you can see the fountain and memorial dedicated to those victims. We know that this ceremony ends at 930, followed by a time to reflect, a moment of silence, and a moment for people to come and visit this memorial. As I mentioned, as you can see behind me, just a lot of people here to remember and honor those lives lost. Natasha, I'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Jasmine, thank you so much.